Breton Language, Wikipedia Article Audio 50 ABBB or in Morbihan is a southwestern Britonic Celtic language spoken in Brittany. History and Status Revival Efforts Breton was brought from Great Britain to Armorica by migrating Britons during the early Middle Ages, it is thus an insular Celtic language, and as such not closely related to the continental Celtic Gaulish language which had been spoken in pre-Roman Gaul. Breton is most closely related to Cornish, both being southwestern Britonic languages. Welsh and the extinct Cumbric are the more distantly related Western Britonic languages. The other regional language of Brittany, Gallo, is a long d oil. Gallo is consequently close to French, although not mutually intelligible, and a Romance language descended from Latin. Having declined from more than 1 million speakers around 1950 to about 200,000 in the first decade of the 21st century, Breton is classified as severely endangered by the UNESCO Atlas of the World's Languages in Danger. However, the number of children attending bilingual classes has risen 33% between 2006 and 2012 to 14,709. Breton is spoken in Lower Brittany, roughly to the west of a line linking Pluha and La Roche-Bernard. It comes from a Britonic language community that once extended from Great Britain to Armorica and had even established a toehold in Galicia. Old Breton is attested from the 9th century. It was the language of the upper classes until the 12th century, after which it became the language of commoners in Lower Brittany. The nobility, followed by the bourgeoisie, adopted French. The written language of the Duchy of Brittany was Latin, switching to French in the 15th century. There exists a limited tradition of Breton literature. Some old Breton vocabulary remains in the present day as philosophical and scientific terms in modern Breton. The recognized stages of the Breton language are, Old Breton, C.800 to C.1100, Middle Breton, C.1100 to C.1650, Modern Breton, C.1650 to present. The French monarchy was not concerned with the minority languages of France spoken by the lower classes, and required the use of French for government business as part of its policy of national unity. During the French Revolution, the government introduced policies favoring French over the regional languages, which it pejoratively referred to as patois. The revolutionaries assumed that reactionary and monarchist forces preferred regional languages to try to keep the peasant masses under-informed. In 1794, Bertrand Berry submitted his report on the Patois to the Committee of Public Safety in which he said that federalism and superstition speak Breton. Geographic Distribution and Dialects since the 19th century, under the Third, Fourth, and Fifth Republics, the government has attempted to stamp out minority languages, including Breton, in state schools, in an effort to build a national culture. Teachers humiliated students for using their regional languages, and such practices prevailed until the late 1960s. In the early 21st century, Due to the political centralization of France, the influence of the media, and the increasing mobility of people, only about 200,000 people can speak Breton, a dramatic decline from more than a million in 1950. The majority of today's speakers are more than 60 years old, and Breton is now classified as an endangered language. Official Status at the beginning of the 20th century, half of the population of Lower Brittany knew only Breton, the other half were bilingual. 
By 1950, there were only 100,000 monolingual Bretons, and this rapid decline has continued, with likely no monolingual speakers left today. A statistical survey in 1997 found around 300,000 speakers in Lower Brittany, of whom about 190,000 were aged 60 or older. Few 15 to 19 year olds spoke Breton. In 1925, Professor Roparts Hemmen founded the Breton language review Guillarn. During its 19 year run, Guillarn tried to raise the language to the level of a great international language. Its publication encouraged the creation of original literature in all genres and proposed Breton translations of internationally recognized foreign works. In 1946, Aliam replaced Guillarn. Other Breton language periodicals have been published, which established a fairly large body of literature for a minority language. In 1977, Dewan schools were founded to teach Breton by immersion. They taught a few thousand young people from elementary school to high school. See the education section for more information. Nation The Asterix comic series has been translated into Breton. According to the comic, the Gaulish village where Asterix lives is in the Armorica Peninsula, which is now Brittany. Some other popular comics have also been translated into Breton, including The Adventures of Tintin, Spiro, Tytuf, Hager the Horrible, Peanuts and Yakari. Constitution Some original media are created in Breton. The sitcom, Can Touch, is in Breton. Radio Kettern, broadcasting from Finisterre has exclusively Breton programming. Some movies and TV series have also been translated and broadcast in Breton. Poets, singers, linguists and writers who have written in Breton, including Yann Berkalak H, Roparts Hemmen, Angela Duval, Xavier de Langlais, Perjakes Helius, Ewan Gwernig, Glenmer and Alan Stavell are now known internationally. Region Today, Breton is the only living Celtic language that is not recognized by national government as an official or regional language. The first Breton dictionary, the Catholicon, was also the first French dictionary. Edited by Jehan Lagay Deck in 1464, it was a trilingual work containing Breton, French, and Latin. Today bilingual dictionaries have been published for Breton and languages including English, Dutch, German, Spanish and Welsh. A new generation is determined to gain international recognition for Breton. The monolingual dictionary, Geriater Brezonag and here, defines Breton words in Breton. The first edition contained about 10,000 words and the second edition of 2001 contains 20,000 words. Education In the early 21st century, the FEAR Brezoneg began a campaign to encourage daily use of Breton in the region by both businesses and local communes. Efforts include installing bilingual signs and posters for regional events, as well as encouraging the use of the Spilhunig to let speakers identify each other. The office also started an internationalization and localization policy asking Google, Firefox and SPIP to develop their interfaces in Breton. In 2004, the Breton Wikipedia started, which now counts more than 50,000 articles. In March 2007, the FEAR Brezoneg signed a tripartite agreement with Regional Council of Brittany and Microsoft for the consideration of the Breton language in Microsoft products. In October 2014,
Facebook added Breton as one of its 121 languages. After three years of talks between the AFI and Facebook, Breton is spoken mainly in Lower Brittany, but also in a more dispersed way in Upper Brittany, and in areas around the world that have Breton emigrants. The four traditional dialects of Breton correspond to medieval bishoprics rather than to linguistic divisions. They are Leoneg, Trigirig, Kernavec, and Gwenadeg. Garandais was spoken up to the beginning of the 20th century in the region of Garanda and Bats sur Mer. There are no clear boundaries between the dialects because they form a dialect continuum, varying only slightly from one village to the next. Gwenadeg, however, is almost mutually unintelligible with most of the other dialects. As noted, only French is an official language of France. Supporters of Breton and other minority languages continue to argue for their recognition, education in public schools and place in public life. Statistics In July 2008, the legislature amended the French Constitution, adding Article 75 to 1. Les Longues Regionales Appartiennent au Patrimoine de la France. Municipalities The European Charter for Regional or Minority Languages, which obliges signatory states to recognize minority and regional languages, was signed by France in 1999 but has not been ratified. On October 27, 2015, the Senate rejected a draft constitutional law ratifying the Charter. Regional and departmental authorities use Breton to a very limited extent, for example in signage. Some bilingual signage has also been installed, such as street name signs in Breton towns. One station of the Rennes metro system has signs in both French and Breton. Under the French law known as Tubon, it is illegal for commercial signage to be in Breton alone. Signs must be bilingual or French only. Since commercial signage usually has limited physical space, most businesses have signs only in French. A fee public AR Brezoneg, the Breton Language Agency was set up in 1999 by the Brittany region to promote and develop the daily use of Breton. It created the ADAR Brezoneg campaign, to encourage enterprises, organizations and communes to promote the use of Breton, for example by installing bilingual signage or translating their websites into Breton. Other Forms of Education Phonology Vowels Consonants In the late 20th century, the French government considered incorporating the independent Breton language immersion schools into the state education system. This action was blocked by the French Constitutional Council based on the 1994 amendment to the Constitution that establishes French as the language of the Republic. Therefore, no other language may be used as a language of instruction in state schools. The Tubon law implemented the amendment, asserting that French is the language of public education. The Dewan schools were founded in Brittany in 1977 to teach Breton by immersion. They taught a few thousand young people from elementary school to high school. They have gained fame owing to their high level of results in school exams. Breton language schools do not receive funding from the national government, though the Brittany region may fund them. Another teaching method is a bilingual approach by DIVs in the state schools, created in 1979. Dihun was created in 1990 for bilingual education in the Catholic schools. In 2012, 14,709 pupils attended Dewan, Divs and Dihun schools. Their number has increased yearly. 
Geneva Le Dryan, the president of the regional council, had a goal of 20,000 pupils by 2010, but is encouraged by their progress. In 2007, some 4,500 to 5,000 adults followed a Breton language course. The family transmission of Breton in 1999 is estimated to be 3%. Growth of the Percentage of Pupils in Bilingual Education Percentage of Pupils in Bilingual Education per Department Grammar The ten communes with the highest percentage of pupils in bilingual primary education, listed with their total population. The ten communes of historic Brittany with the highest total population listed with their percentages of pupils in bilingual primary education. In addition to bilingual education the region has introduced the Breton language in primary education, mainly in the department of Finisterre. These initiation sessions are generally one to three hours per week, and consist of songs and games. Verbal Aspect Inflected Prepositions Initial consonant mutations Schools in secondary education offer some courses of Breton, such as German or Spanish. In 2010, nearly 5,000 students in Brittany were reported to be taking this option. Additionally, the University of Rennes too has a Breton language department offering courses in the language along with a master's degree in Breton and Celtic studies. Vowels in Breton may be short or long. All unstressed vowels are short, stressed vowels can be short or long. All vowels can also be nasalized, which is noted by appending an N letter after the base vowel, or by adding a combining tilde above the vowel, or more commonly by non-ambiguously appending an N letter after the base vowel. Diphthongs are slash AI. EI slash. As in English as well as the other Celtic languages, a variety of verbal constructions are available to express grammatical aspect, for example showing a distinction between progressive and habitual actions. Vocabulary As in other modern Celtic languages, Breton pronouns are fused into preceding prepositions to produce a sort of conjugated preposition. Below are some examples in Breton, Cornish, Welsh, Irish, Scottish Gaelic, and Manx, along with English translations. Breton has four initial consonant mutations, though modern Breton lost the nasal mutation of Welsh, it also has a hard mutation in which voiced stops become voiceless, and a mixed mutation, which is a mixture of hard and soft mutations. The English words dolmen and menhir have been borrowed from French, which took them from Breton. However, this is uncertain, for instance, menhir is poulven or mainhir, main sav in Breton. Dolmen is a misconstructed word. Some studies state that these words were borrowed from Cornish. Main here can be directly translated from Welsh as long stone. The Cornish surnames Menir, Menir, and Manhire all derive from the Cornish men HYR, as does Truman Hare settlement by the long stone. The French word Baraguiner is derived from Breton Bara and Gwyn. The French word Goland is derived from Breton Gwellen, which shares the same root as English Gull. The first extant Breton texts, contained in the late manuscript, were written at the end of the 8th century, 50 years prior to the Strasbourg Oaths, considered to be the earliest example of French. Like many medieval orthographies, Old and Middle Breton orthography was at first not standardized, and the spelling of a particular word varied at author's discretion. In 1499, however, the Catholicon, 
was published, as the first dictionary written for both French and Breton, it became a point of reference on how to transcribe the language. The orthography presented in the Catholicon was largely similar to that of French, in particular with respect to the representation of vowels, as well as the use of both the Latinate digraph chu a remnant of the sound change slash k slash slash k slash in Latin and Britonic ku or cu to represent slash k slash before front vowels. As phonetic and phonological differences between the dialects began to magnify, many regions, particularly the Van country, began to devise their own orthographies. Many of these orthographies were more closely related to the French model, albeit with some modifications. Examples of these modifications include the replacement of Old Breton Z with H to denote word final slash XH slash and use of H to denote the initial mutation of slash K slash. And thus needed another transcription. In the 1830s Jean-Francois L. E. Gonidec created a modern phonetic system for the language. During the early years of the 20th century, a group of writers known as M. Gulvar Scrivanerian elaborated and reformed L. E. Gonidec's system. They made it more suitable as a super-dialectal representation of the dialects of Cornwall, Leon, and Treger. This KLT orthography was established in 1911. At the same time writers of the more divergent Vanitaeus dialect developed a phonetic system also based on that of L. E. Gonidec. Following proposals made during the 1920s, the KLT and Vanitaeus orthographies were merged in 1941 to create an orthographic system to represent all four dialects. This Purunvan orthography was significant for the inclusion of the ZH digraph, which represents a slash H slash in Vanitaeus and corresponds to a slash Z slash in the KLT dialects. In 1955 Francois Falcon and the group Emga EO Briais proposed a new orthography. It was designed to use a set of graphemes closer to the conventions of French. This orthography universitaire was given official recognition by the French authorities as the official orthography of Breton in French education. It was opposed in the region and today is used only by the magazine Brudneve and the publishing house Emga Eo Briais. Words that passed into French and into English Orthography Between 1971 and 1974, a new standard orthography was devised the Atrian Yechel or Interdialectal. This system is based on the derivation of the words. Today the majority of writers continue to use the Purunvan orthography, and it is the version taught in most Breton language schools. Alphabet Due to the deficient suitableness of those standardized, Interdialectal orthography for many dialects they are seen as a threat by some activists, rather than as a helping tool for promoting and spreading the language because it endangers the rich variety of the still living dialects and encourages the usage of a de facto non existent artificial language. Differences between Skalvurig and Purunvan Pronunciation of the Breton alphabet Examples Lord's Prayer Words and Phrases in Breton Language Comparison Dictionaries Learning Breton is written in the Latin script. Purunvan, the most commonly used orthography, consists of the following letters. The circumflex, grave accent, trema, and tilde appear on some letters. These diacritics are used in the following way. CV Introduction to Breton slash Breton Pronunciation for an Introduction to the Breton Alphabet and Pronunciation Both orthographies use the above alphabet, although E is used only in Skalvurig. 
Differences between the two systems are particularly noticeable in word endings. In Puranvan, final obstruents, which are devoiced in absolute final position and voiced in sandy before voiced sounds, are represented by a grapheme that indicates a voiceless sound. In OU they are written as voiced but represented as voiceless before suffixes, braz, brasok h. In addition, Puranvan maintains the KLT convention, which distinguishes noun-slash-adjective pairs by nouns written with a final voiced consonant and adjectives with a voiceless one. No distinction is made in pronunciation, e.g. Brezoneg Breton language versus Brezoneg Breton. Some examples of words in the different orthographies. Notes Visitors to Brittany may encounter words and phrases such as the following.